Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us in symbolism. On our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, today we're going to take a look at some of the signs of the Ark of Jesus' Testament and the door to heaven. In Revelation 11, after the seventh trumpet, Jesus takes his Ark up to heaven. And the temple of God was opened in heaven, and there was seen in his temple the Ark of his Testament. And there were lightnings and voices and thunderings and an earthquake and great hail. We show how all of the world is as a matrix and these signs happen all around us and the only way to explain it is to trust God that everything's written in the Bible even the bad guy is written in the Bible even the devil has parts written in the Bible so we're all heading towards this end time event whenever that shall happen let's let's not be in a hurry well, these things are showing all around us. Played out right in front of us through all of our human host bodies here on the earth. All of us. Just even as with Taylor Swift. She represents a big part of the Bible and part of the biblical end times with the earthquake. This video here, Shake It Off, represents that great earthquake coming and everybody going up to heaven and then the beast being released. See her all right here with the cheerleaders and everybody ready to go up? It's also shown in this one here, Look What You Made Me Do, where everything's torn apart and she tears this jet up. See here? Representing locking the door, that it's all over when the great earthquake happens. These things are shown all around us. See? Revelation 12 the dragon is fighting the woman and the woman has Jesus Christ who is ready to go to the throne and the woman is granted the wings of a great eagle to fight the dragon these things are shown all around us shake it off represents the great earthquake and this here this plane represents the black pearl just like the pearl that Jesus Christ talked of this can get you past judgment just as in the movies See it there? Well, these things are mapped out all around us. This is one other area where things are mapped out. Down here near Salt Lake City. See Salt Lake City? How are these things mapped out all around us? They, they just are. See Taylorsville? Taylor herself doesn't know any of these things. That's just another avatar for the spirits. Just as Jesus Christ said, the you either have the Holy Ghost with you or something else is using you. So these things play out all around us like a great story. See where it says Taylorville? Taylor? Fantasy Bridal? See the fantasy represents your heaven, your dream. See the fantasy? The Bride. When the great earthquake happens. See? Shake it off. the dragon. Well these things are mapped out all around us. Can you see the big dragon? It's not small guys. Come on, this is this is universal. Come on, the whole earth was created. Can you see the big alligator dragon? How is this done? It's trusting God. All the way from where you were born to where you are at right now, there's a weaving of fate. See the dragon? And it's trying to hold the ark down. There's the ark. The bride. Mark's ark. They use the name Mark many times because it's the second book in the Bible, meaning the second coming of Jesus Christ. Matthew, then Mark. See, Mark's ark. Taylor. The bridal. And the alligator is trying to keep us all trapped. 
don't worry, it's all okay. This ark, we have a door. We actually have a door to heaven, even right here, right now. As everything's going on, it's okay. See? Heaven's Gate. See the name of that right there? Heaven's Gate. Now you can even see. See Taylorsville and the blue and the gold? The blue has a lot to do with Israel. There you go. Going up to heaven. Then the ark is shut down. There's no more door. Jesus shuts his door. So let's not be in a hurry for that. I mean, once he shuts the door, it's Armageddon. It's going to be a whole different world coming. So there's the ark. There's Taylor. There's the beast. Just be satisfied that it's all real. Don't be in a hurry. As we go through our lives, we have a door. We have a door. See, heaven's gate. When we pass, when 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 you die on this earth, as long as you're with Jesus, you're going to go to heaven. That's what all of this means. Concrete evidence. Believe in your salvation. Trust in the Lord Jesus. Is it all right there? Terrorville. So see how it plays out all around us? And don't single her out. The spirits use the whole earth. Billions of people. All different videos and things. And also Satan will do different things. Remember Kanye West attacking her? Kanye West makes videos of destroying the world and of the beast coming. So see how these things play out? So there's a, there's a, a balance all around us. But there's the jet. Shake it off for the great earthquake at the biblical end times. There it all is right there. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Prince of Peace. This means we have peace on earth. When this is all gone, it's going to be war. War. In heaven and on earth. Even Michael has to get up and has to fight the dragon. So let's keep patience. And I'll see all of you at the wedding feast of the Lamb. Enjoy the creation of God. Enjoy every moment of life we all have. Be kind to everyone you can. It's all all right. I'll see all of you at the wedding feast of the Lamb, and may God have mercy on us all. Thank you very much, everybody. Hallelujah.